Hi, water signs, Pisces, Cairns and Scorpio, Ascendant, Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising and those cross-watching, welcome to your Tarot Love Messages. Today we're going to take a look at and see where is this connection going, okay? So we want to see where things are heading, okay? It is going to be a general reading, so please just keep that in mind. If you're interested in a personalized tarot reading with myself, please feel free to reach out and inquire. I will list my email address just below the video here in the show more section. Otherwise, guys, let's begin. I want you to focus on your romantic energy and we want to see where things are heading, in what direction, uh, how far might things go with you and this person. Okay, so straight away you have the Hermit here. Okay, so for some of you, I can see that um, you might be going through a no contact or no communication period. You may be going through a time where either you yourself feel very withdrawn or your person may have withdrawn from you or emotionally distanced themselves a little bit here. Especially as indicated by the hermit mode, someone might have crawled into hermit mode here. Someone may need some time on their own here to do some thinking reflecting ruminating here to me it feels as though someone is doing some really deep thinking about you or about this connection here okay the hermit often appears in our life during a very pivotal point when we're considering a new direction or when we've recently met someone therefore we're doing some really deep thinking here how will this person fit into our life is there a future you know, with this person, what does the future look like here with this person in it? So I can see that if your individual is, if your energy rather, is a little bit distance or just not the usual self lately here, I feel like your person is doing a lot of thinking. There could be other areas of their life that are very distracting right now. But when it comes between when it comes to you and your romantic connection with this person, I feel like they're just trying to figure out their feelings, their um, emotions here, and just I see them reevaluating. They're looking at they're trying to look at their life here and your connection with them with a more deeper um, understanding here. I'm also seeing that there may be some priorities that are shifting in their life here as well. Now, the Hermit also appears in our path when we're ready to raise our vibrations, enhance our consciousness here. So perhaps the other reason why there is a slight disconnect or discord between you and your person right now is because they need to raise their vibrations maybe to suit yours or you, you might need to raise your vibration to suit theirs. So I feel like if the both of you are experiencing some sort of disconnection or quiet period, no contact, no communication, it's really a blessing in disguise because when the two of you come back together, it feels like it'll maybe a little bit more stronger here. Okay, I do feel like there are feelings invested in this connection, especially with the suit of cups here making an appearance. I do feel like there are emotions, even if it's early days, there is a sense of an energy of familiarity, an energy of this person feeling like home to you. For some of you, this is a past energy. This is someone whom you've had history with this person. Could be a childhood sweetheart. Could be someone whom you might have dated or you might have, you know, casually and romantically been involved with one another and you're deciding to revisit things here or give uh, this connection another chance here. There's obviously an emotional connection from what I'm seeing, an emotional thread that that ties the two of you together, especially if you have known this person from a uh, 
from the past here. We want to know where this is going. As for the no contact, no communication period, I am seeing that there is going to be a mental breakthrough. So there will be communication after a period of silence. Someone here is willing to break their silence. The other person is willing to respond. But I feel like that you have to understand that that comes off the heels of that hermit mode okay so this person has whatever it is that they're going to come and tell you here they've been giving this a lot of thought okay so best believe that they've you know um, thought about it and analyzed it and even analyzed it in the process as well I'm also seeing that perhaps emotions are really high and I feel like maybe this person is feeling really like their emotional tensions are very high and the other reason why that I feel like they're Pulled away look it could have been because you guys have had some sort of argument or a disagreement but I feel like it was the mature thing for, for them to do to pull away purely because it feels as though they normally wouldn't have responded in a way which would have kept a peace so this is their way of just trying to calm their energy calm themselves and then come back and reach out to you when they're feeling a little bit more like their usual self here um, but with the King of Cups, whenever it makes an appearance in a tarot card, it does often reflect a person who would make a good mother or father here, who would make a very good parental figure. This um, King of Cups does have a strong masculine um, energy as well, but he has a lot to do with emotion. So I feel like if your person is coming across as a bit of an alpha or someone who you know, doesn't want to seem as though they're very emotionally involved in this connection, even if it is early on. It just seems that I feel like this person is appearing really strong and powerful, but it's important for you to know that they do have feelings for you, okay? And yes, this person is aware of their feelings, and perhaps maybe that's why they've also pulled away, because, you know, they're just trying to process these feelings, these emotions, or whatever it is that's going on with them. I do feel like there's going to be an important conversation in this connection that I feel like is going to be extremely instrumental in whether or not your connection makes it, okay? Because I feel like there's something here that might be said which may bring things to the surface of this connection. Like if there are issues that you're experiencing in the connection here, um, or if you feel like they're not emotionally expressive, I feel like someone here is being really... Um, honest in their approach they're being very transparent and it's forcing the other person to really take a very like a much more closer look as well at their response here so I feel like an important conversation that perhaps you might have been avoiding for quite some time but it needs to be had because it's going to define a turning point in this connection and the turning point is that it's going to bring certain issues that may have plagued the relationship or this connection to the surface so that you can deal with them and stop pretending like they're not there, okay? I can see that someone is going to be a little bit defiant here. Someone is going to be a little bit defensive when it comes to this conversation. But look, certain things need to be said and certain things need to be heard as well here is what I'm seeing. And that is really going to mark a turning point or like a breakthrough in this connection. I feel like this is someone whom you're going to go on and possibly have um, a very strong relationship or a very strong connection with this person. I feel like they will remain on in your life. It may not be that this person may stay in your life as a romantic lover. They could remain in your life as a friend, but I feel like this person is going to be very special to you and I can definitely see this person playing an important role in your future here. For some of you, you are. This is a connection that you're going to be slowly building on, okay? It does feel intense. It does feel like there are certain issues emotional barriers that need to be addressed and need to be looked at closely but if you can sort of get over those hurdles then I really feel like you're building a very strong foundational structure for a relationship here there's such a closeness in this connection that I'm seeing it's um quite an emotion a close emotional bond that I'm picking up for you here okay and it's a connection that feels very powerful one that I feel like holds you know, it shows a lot of power and it shows a lot of control here as well. So yes, this person will continue to play a role in your life. Um, someone here, I feel like, needs to learn to keep their cool in turbulent situations. Um, I also feel like you'll be entering a period where you may 
end or close a chapter with this person of some sort and then begin a new one okay especially with the world card here for some of you if this is a past person i see a reconnection i see you reuniting re-energizing renew renewing revisiting things from the past but in a renewed kind of energy so it's not like you're picking up where you left off but you're taking a look at what didn't work in the connection earlier on and then sort of dissecting that so that you could move on in a much more stronger powerful way here okay so where's this connection going i feel like it is going to have a few bumps and hurdles in the future but i feel like the two of you got you have what it takes to navigate those emotional territories too because it feels like the entire emotional spectrum of this connection is that someone needs to take well the both of you might need to take for uh, you might need to take responsibility for how you feel about yourself in this connection and how you feel about the connection overall and you know the world around you here so for instance they may have habits that they hold that may be hurting you or you may have habits that you hold that might be hurting them indirectly so it's important that the both of you take responsibility for the role that you play in this connection but it definitely has a future it's just you know if you learn to sort of navigate those emotional territories um which i think you've got what it takes the both of you then i definitely see that this person will go on to play a very important role in your future Alright guys, and these are your messages, so thank you as always for watching and listening. Please show your support by liking, sharing, um, subscribing. Thanks guys again. Bye for now.